All right. Hello, everybody. Travis Chandler here, Chandler Gaming, back with episode eight of the Mass Effect Engineer series. Wearing a green shirt today. I mean, I'm probably going to bite me in the ass, but oh well. I'm just going to do something different. If it screws up my face cam a little bit, oh well. You know, it gets you paying attention. <laughs> It should pay attention. So what adventure are we going to get into today? I believe this is going to be Pharos. Today. Let's find out. Yep. Pharos it is. Pharos it is. Alright. There, that's better. That is better. It's coming in. <laughs> Normandy, this is Alliance Command. We're detecting your presence in the Attican Beta Cluster. One of our surveillance drones was gathering intel on Geth activities in the region when it was spotted and shot down. We need to go ground side and recover the drone's data module before the Geth find it. I have the greatest idea for a short. I do, or I'm gonna do it later. <laughs> where the fuck is the drone? I always forget where that drone is. There it is. This is the surveillance drone, but where is the data module? Stupid monkey. Don't worry about searching the monkeys outside. They don't have it. It's not that easy. It's deep down in the mine. Deep down in the mine. That's where it is. It's in here. I believe you have to go in both of them to find it. The data module is still intact. Joker can transmit this info to Alliance Command. Yeah, I bet he can. Oh, here comes the Gath looking for it. Boom, motherfuckers. Boom. Overload that shit. 
Boom! And that's how you take care of Kath. Just like that. Okay. Now off to Pharos we go. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. <laughs> yeah, this idea for the short is just killing me. <laughs> we saw your ship. Fight Dan wants to speak with you immediately. What's so important he needs to see me right away? The Geth are making another push. Fidan is preparing our defenses, but he needs your help. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. We got them both. Look at that. Look at that. We got them both. Down they went. Head to the tunnels. Make sure they're secure. But what if I find Geth there? Are you saying you won't go? No, uh, I'll go. Excuse me. I've been up since about five o'clock this morning. There, there, there. You'll get through this. Just relax. My headaches are getting better. I just have to stop thinking about the past. Hello, Offworlder. I'm glad that we are totally forgotten by the rest of the galaxy. Dear, please try to rest. You're you're not ready to speak. But they should know. Uh, I mean, they are very important. Yes, that's better. Is there anything I can do for you? I'm fine. I just need to try to think clearly. It's just a lingering pain from, from the last attack. I'll be fine. She looks whole, but something's clearly causing her pain. Please, just let her rest. She just needs rest. Okay. Oh, Commander. I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since... Watch out! We've got Geth in the tower! Do we really? Protect the heart of the colony! Okay, we sure will. That's what we do. That is what we do. Ho oh, ho! As you can see, engineers are so overpowered. 
We're gonna go in and murder all these geth. We're gonna go boom. As you can see, my recharge rate is fucking fast. Boom. Out of the way, Ashley. Stupid. This ain't the kitchen. Get the fuck out the way. You know? There, we got those bastards out of there, didn't we? <laughs> Stood no chance against a frickin' engineer. Are we ready to roll out to wherever the Geth are bunkered? Check in with Fidan, but I think we're done here. We could be done here, but we're not. The tower's secure, thanks to you, Commander. I'm just glad your colony is safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. What do they want? If you want answers, go ask them yourselves. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. How do I get there? The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. Every Geth I kill brings me one step closer to Saren. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. We'll get going then. Good luck, Commander. All right. So now we're gonna do the optional quests. Really, if you're gonna kill the colonists, you really shouldn't do this. But you're the one who repelled that last wave. They'll be back, and if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Varen meat, but it's too dangerous. The Alpha Varen. He's huge and he's mad. Rabid, maybe. Totally uncontrollable. I can't do anything until he's dead. Okay. I have to go. So long, Commander. Nice work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. Yeah, I am too. <laughs> I still need the power cells for this generator, though. If I find anything while I'm looking around, I'll send it your way. Thank you, Commander. I appreciate it. I'm sorry, but I can't stop to talk. I have to deal with the water shortage. Is there anything I can do? The utilities building was one of the first to fall under Geth control. Find the mains and turn them back on. Until then, this colony is dry. I have to go. I wish you luck. Okay. Ledra. Commander, I was told to make my supplies available to you, if you wish. Let me see what you have. Of course. I may be able to provide a few interesting items. There we go. Nope, it's not any better than what we've got because we've got the vector weapon, so... We got them both. Look at that. We got them both. <laughs> right in between the two columns. That's a pretty impressive shot. <laughs> And here I'm just trying to figure out what I'm going to do for the rest of the levels here. Um, I think I max out decryption and hacking. Valve 
itself looks like part of a large system. There are likely others we need to activate as well. There's another one. Doesn't look like it's been activated yet, though. We should keep looking. Okay. We will. As soon as we come in here. And here's Krogan. There we go. And now we leveled up. Oh, I do hacking first. And then I do decryption. Because hacking does your recharge rate. That's right. I forgot about that. And I forgot the other two. Stupid me. Don't know why I didn't cut this out, but oh well. Still forgot to do the other two's um, points. There we go. Okay, stupid Varen. Nope, we didn't get them all. There's the Alpha. There we go. Okay, so we took out the power cells, we took care of a transmitter, and we took care of the Alpha Baron. So, now we got one more to do, and that's the water shortage, which is right here, but stupid me forgets to hit the water main. But hey, I got AI hacking specialists. Look at that. Nice. Oh, I got it right there. Cool. Turning this last valve appears to have activated the system, Commander. You don't want to go down there. What's back there? I could tell you. Tell you everything. How would you like that? No! That was a good one. Very intense. What's the matter with you? Just invoking the Master's whip. Helps remind me I'm still alive. You're here for the Geth, aren't you? You're not the only one interested in those things. Who else is looking for the Geth? Not looking for. Looking to get rid of. They're a thorn in the side of the- Damn! I'm to get to the- <laughs> Let's leave him. There's nothing we can do for him. 
Is there anything I can do to help you? Do you even want help? Help me? No. No one can help me now. I'd rather die fighting! Fighting what? Not that kind of fight. It's like running through a thorn bush. The more you struggle... Time's up. Company's coming. Ask Fidan. Ask him about the... Ah! Look out! Okay, we make it back to fight, Dan. I wasn't going to record running back, so... Commander, what can I do for you? I destroyed a Geth transmitter in the tunnels. It won't be a problem any longer. Thank you, Commander. We're in your debt. You've taken a great weight off my shoulders. I just wish I had such good news for everybody. <laughs> I'll talk to you when I learn more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hello again, Commander. I killed the big Varen. The rest are yours. Excellent. I'll organize a hunt when the immediate threat of the Geth is gone. I have to go. Here, for your trouble. It's not much I know, but it's all we can spare. Nice work with those Geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Here, Fidan gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Now if I can kick these power cells into place, I'll have this colony up and running in no time. The water started running not long ago. Thanks to you, I assume. Now we just need to deal with the Geth and we can get back to growing this colony. Here. Few credits for your trouble. Thank you again, Commander. All right. Well, I should have cut out here too, because all you do is fight a couple of drones and then you leave. Damn right, let's take it to him. We've got movement. Some kind of vehicle. Not one of the Geth. The plot is unvisual. We must be close. Shouldn't we be more concerned about the Geth? Technically, you're right, Ashley, but... I checked to see if I can go this way. You can't. Not, they do that on purpose to get you to check. That's close enough. Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? I suggest you put that weapon down unless you're ready to use it. Yeah, damn it. Don't worry about him. He only cares about the company. And you trust too easily, Juliana. Shut up. I'm glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. Fidan and some of the members of Zoo's Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. I said they were probably all dead. They're not dead, but the Geth have really pounded them. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. Are we getting close to their base? You're almost there. They're holed up in the Exogeny headquarters, just a bit further down the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. I'm not interested in your company's secrets. 
Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We could do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. That's my daughter you're talking about. She's still alive. I know it. Where is your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. <coughs> For a short time. <coughs> if she's in there, I'll get her. Excuse me. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the cat is. <coughs> of course. And please remember, if you see my daughter... I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. What do you need? I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Sounds easy enough. What's the catch? No catch, really. It's dangerous work, but not for someone like you. Deadly for him, fine for us. What could be better? Exactly. It's not that <laughs> really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. Okay, and here I am at Exogeny. Hey, she got him. Nice. And we got him in the head. <laughs> nice. There, we got him. <laughs> I tell you, these engineers, they're so overpowered. They really are. One-way drop, Commander. Whoa. safe now. But why were you here in the first place? It's my own fault. Everyone else was running and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. We'll get you out as soon as we find out what the Geth are after. It's not the Geth. It's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... I'm here for the Geth. It's very important I find out what they're after. Yeah, damn it. I don't know for certain, but I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. Thorian? I have never heard of such a thing. It's an indigenous life form. Exogeny was studying it. What else can you tell me? Do you know where I can find this Thorian? I... I might be able to, but not with those Geth crawling around everywhere. Look, we need to get out of here, past that field. Do you know how we can shut it down? No, not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. All right. I'll look into it. Stay put until the field is down. Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice. I'll just find a small hole to hide in until the field is down. <coughs> oh, here, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck with that field. Stupid Baron. Go 
stupid machine! Access encrypted! No, I don't want to review protocol! I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! <laughs> Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with... Stupid machine! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, Research Assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of Subject Species 37, the Thorian. What did you tell him? I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What? What does Zoo's Hope have to do with <laughs> Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. You bastards. All along, what would happen to those people? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. Yeah? That explains their strange behavior. We should warn Joker. Joker. Come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. We must find a way around the field. We must get back to Zuzu. V.I., what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. We need to find that ship. Let's get moving. Going to standby mode. Okay. So now... We go and find out how to take down the field. Very easily, I will say. <laughs> Up here. Yeah! Hell yeah, Ashley! That was a great fucking bit of dialogue! Now we go up. No, not that one. This one. If you got the side quest from Gavin. There we go. We got him killed.
Okay, the Nexus helps for now. But we'll get a better one here soon. Boom! Always use your powers as an engineer. Always use your powers as an engineer. You want to concentrate on recharge and your power bonus. We got rid of them all. This commander, a containment lab. It is an asset we lacked at the other claws. Dislodge even one claw, and that ship will fall. There, we got it. There we go. That's how you do that. London Bridge is falling. <laughs> Doors will be open now. We can go deal with that Thorian thing. Damn. I'd like to have seen the face on their pilot when that thing toppled. I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. They can't do any real damage. We're on our way back. Just hold your position. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right here for you, Commander. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. All right. So I cut that out, which I'm so glad I did. We should get out of here. I don't think this place is safe. You said you didn't know about the Thorian. I don't like being lied to. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. When the Geth attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I, I, I never meant for this to happen. You did what you could. I'll help them, if you can tell me where to find the Thorian. The Thorian is underneath Zoo's Hope, but the entrance is blocked. The colonists covered it with the freighter just before the Geth attacked. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. That's what Exogeny was interested in. Normandy to shore party, come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm shatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to help. Undo the mess I helped create. All right. So now we're going to head back and see Juliana. Is there anybody? Is there anyone picking this up? Get away from that radio. What was that all about? This is Juliana Raynham of Pharaoh's Colony. Please help us. This is wrong. Stop. Stop the rover. 
Now, you could leave them if you wanted, but fuck it. We're going to go and help again. Because that's what we do. You can't do this, John. Everyone shut up. Uh, let me think. What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard. Damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogeny database. I know what happened on a coups. This doesn't have to end like that. Not this time, Jean. You need to back down and let them go. You, you don't understand. It's not that easy. Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, Jong. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. Are you gonna tell them about the Thorian? Or should I? The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus Hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, Jong. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. You're a bean counter, Jong. I'm a specter. Tell me, how good are those odds? <laughs> specter, it's a load of crap. There aren't any human specters. Right? Is that really a chance you're willing to take, John? Exogeny will send more assayers. They'll know what happened. Tell them the Geth destroyed the Thorian. Yeah, but the infected colonists can't be here when the company men come. You can't just kill the colonists. It's not their fault. If you kill only the Thorian, it might be enough to stop the infection. Maybe. It's worth a try, but I don't know if I can avoid harming the colonists. There has to be another way. Maybe there is. Come and talk to me before you leave, Commander. Just make sure there's no evidence when you're done. Again, I was just sitting here trying to plan out my moves. I'm glad you've decided to help us. I think there's a way to avoid killing the colonists. What did you have in mind? I think you could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. We'll stay out of your way until you clear a path. Okay. So we're going to equip it now so I don't forget. <laughs> Good luck. <clears throat> Any luck finding my workstation out in the ruins? I managed to find the data and transfer it to your OSD. That's very good news indeed, thank you. I was there anyway. It was the least I could do. Well, I appreciate it. Here, you've certainly earned this. Thanks again, Commander. Okay. Does to people, but that's not human. No hitting the colonists, even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. Whatever you say, Commander. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. How many colonists do I get saved? We'll find out. There, we got him. All right. Okay. So, yep, this will be at the end of... Here will be the end of the video. Okay. Didn't want to repeat the last video. <laughs> yeah.
Okay, there ain't nothing over here. I thought there was, but no, there isn't. Nope. There we go. There we got him. All right. See, the grenades are kind of hard to throw. I want to try to draw in the creepers. There we go. There we got two of them, okay. See, two of them got hit, and I don't know which to, how they got hit. That's the thing. I don't know if our the team member if the team got them or what. I don't know. There's controls for the crane commander. Can you make sense of them? I don't know how those two got hit. I didn't hit them. I didn't shoot them, you know. You can't imagine the pain. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trust me. It wants me to stop you, but I won't. I won't. Da da da! Yeah, there you go. Come on. You're done here. Yeah, there you go. Come on. Okay, we just have to find this thing and put a couple of rounds into... What the hell is that? Nothing's ever simple, is it? No, it's not. Oh, what the hell? Oh! Oh! It gave birth to an Asari! Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. 
flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies, and will listen no more. I won't let you keep your thralls. Release them, now! No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Your blood is You think? Oh! Oh! It's gonna get no bur more birth! Birthing fluid! Okay, and then we want the weapon locker. There we go. <laughs> Go away, Ashley, shit. There we go! All of them wiped out! Boom! If it weren't for the experience, I'd just skip the creepers. You know? I would. I would just skip the creepers if it weren't for the experience you get for killing them. There we go.
Oh, it will drop soon. Soon as we... I think there's two left. I think there's just two left. Get rid of you. And that's it. Down goes the Thorian. I'm free. I... I suppose I should thank you for releasing me. How did you end up inside that... thing? My name is Shiala. I serve... I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. Benezia sought to turn the river and was swept away. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel, an enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will, the process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Then why were the Geth trying to destroy the Thorian? After Saren had what he needed, the Thorian became a liability. Yeah, he sure did. He knows you are searching for the conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the cipher. What's the cipher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught, it simply exists. I need the cipher. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Okay. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. 
Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. Are you alright, Shepard? What'd she do? I saw... something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. You look a little queasy. We should get you back to the ship. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Okay. Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. Okay. So now we just need the debrief and then we'll be out of here for this video. Jong says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Okay. Well, let's get out of here and get back to the ship. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. Decontamination in progress. Commander, you look... pale. Are you suffering any ill effects from the cipher? I just need some time to let this cipher do its thing. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we can make some sense of it. Do it. Hurry. We don't have much time. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. Why am I so disappointed that Liara's tits don't jiggle? <laughs> that was incredible. All this time, all my research, yet I I never dreamed. I am sorry. The images were so vivid. I never imagined the experience would be so... intense. You are remarkably strong-willed, Commander. What you have been through, what you have seen, would have destroyed a lesser mind. Come on, get to the point. What did you see? The beacon on Eden Prime must have been badly damaged. Large parts of the vision are... are missing. The data transferred into the Commander's mind is incomplete. You must have seen something. I was able to interpret the data relayed through your vision, what was there at least. But something was missing. Saren must have the missing information. Maybe he found another beacon. If we can find the missing data from your vision, I can... I can... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. We're done here. Dismissed. I've sent off the Pharos report, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Commander, Exogenius should have told us about the Thorian. It would have made your job much easier. You might have been able to capture it for study instead of destroying it. 
The only reason to study a creature like that is to figure out how to kill it. Exactly. Yes, kill it. That's how you humans usually deal with things you don't understand. Goodbye, Counselor. Uh oh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. We lost that connection. Uh, well, that's going to be it for this video. Hope you all had fun. I'll see you on the next episode.